to inject the tarsal metatarsal joint on this horse. By injecting, in order to do that, I'm gonna find the spleen bone right above the spleen bone. There's actually a ligament right there that I need to go through, and I push through, and I make sure I'm in. Oh, she's tough. She has a tough little ligament over there. And then I push it in. Nice and easy. I know I'm in the joint. I am going to do the distal intertarsal joint. And to do that, she needs to be putting weight. She's gonna slowly push her back. And then, this one is very easy to do. Find out where I did my previous injection. I draw a horizontal line, lateral to the extensor tendon, about two millimeters above, boom. And guess what? We got fluid. You see that fluid? It's fluid that communicated with the other joints. So in this particular horse, those two joints communicated. That happens in about a little bit over 50% of horses, but not all of them do. That's why I always do both of them.